How you doing, everybody? You know, time of this. A little bit of tasting with the Halloween theme. Anyway, go over there, hit that thumbs up. So you see all these, you know, get the video out to people, help the video out. Get it going, you know. Come over here, you hit the subscribe so you can see more of these. And also, if you check out later in the week, going to have a five below headphones. New five below headphones. Be nice. Anyway. Hit it again, get those two marks up above, you get it on your news feed. You are not seeing an optical illusion, you are not seeing things weird. Don't turn your phones, your Kindles, your tablets, or your laptops upside down. The can is upside down, it's made that way. Yes, it's made that way. It's not like that, I'm trying to play no Halloween tricks on y'all. We are reusing another um, Halloween bandana, because I don't have that many. I can't find any new ones right now. The Halloween store wasn't open yet. It should be open. Maybe by Christmas, the Halloween store will be open. Anyway, Spirit of Halloween is not open as of yet. Hopefully, we go tomorrow. It is. So, I haven't gone over there yet. We only have a few here for some reason. I know the other ones are open, but they're kind of out of the way. So, I want to go to the one that's close. Anyway, we got the beer book. So, we can give this fine beer a rating. Got some of the yellow um, Aldi's corn chips. And a little talky hot spicy ones there. And we're back to the Stone Fear Movies Lion Double IPA with the little Halloween uh, demon guy on there. An unfiltered doubled IPA. 8.5% alcohol. One pint, 3.4, 3, uh, 3.2 full ounces. Sorry about that. Oh, we got a little story. These three millimeter squares are... Random Virginia Brewery with these three words painted on it. What three words exactly for the unta untainted? That's it's hard to read because it's white and silver and I'm reading it through a lens. What three words addressing systems to bring locations to previously un but inspired by positive impact of the system. We decided to name this IPA at the three meter square in the brewery where it is created. Check out. So now, when someone says to you, what's the we words? You can reply with our answer. Right there, what's on the front. So it's a Virginia beer. Enjoy fresh. You have to enjoy this fresh, okay? Can't enjoy it any other way. Best to enjoy fresh. Anyway, <laughs> if you want to check them out, they put everything upside down except for leave no stone unturned.com. That's their little uh, slogan, I guess you could say there. So, let me move the chips to the side. I'm trying to get, let's see if we, oh, they do have the little demon head on top there. It was like the, um, the, um, what you call it? Arrogant one. You know, arrogant. You know, well, yeah. Mm -hmm. ah, the little hiss, the little hiss. Mm. It has got a little citrusy, a little hint to it there. I'm trying to move stuff out of the way here. Anyway, I'm trying to get this a little bit better so we don't dribble all over the place and we get a good one out. And of course, we get a lot of fists, like usual. I tried, I tried, I tried, I really did. <laughs> trying to tip it to, to get that fist, but it didn't work. Mmm. It's got a good, strong taste to it. Put that I don't want to drip beer all over the the bandana you know i gotta use it during the week for the halloween anyway so like i said we're counting down to halloween we're trying to do halloween ones i do have one i picked up today it was a four pack it's extremely halloween but we will unveil that the last week of our leading up to halloween i'm trying to get cans that represent something about halloween that one pretty much represented halloween so we're gonna save that to the end unless we find something else and i'll let you know and then we'll use that one ahead of time. And we'll save the other one for the end. 
But I'm going to be on the lookout to try to find more Halloween-ish or Halloween-themed cans for the week. It's hard to buy them. Oh, they're owned and I don't want to go buy in the case. I just couldn't resist that one, so I bought the four. I know somebody said something about chewing on camera, so. Where's my mic? Try to cover up the microphone. and spicy chips. It's similar to the arrogant, you know. It is similar. But citru more citrus, more strong beer taste. I got the hot chip, so... Let me take a little corn chip to get it away. I'm going to cover the microphone again. I'm going to cover the microphone again. No, don't go over. Don't go over. Don't go over. Thank you. Simmer down now. Settle it down, okay? I know we gotta take another taste, but I'm gonna start marking a blaze here. Oh, this is Stone Brewery. The last one was Fire Walking. I'm assuming different ones. Oh, yes, because that one was California. This is Virginia. Let's make sure. Richmond, Virginia, actually, to be exact. The brewery is Stone Brewery. Let's see. Arrogant was, right? Richmond, Virginia? Yeah, okay. It was the same one as the Arrogant, guys. Origin, Virginia. VA. It's IPA style IPA. I guess I should put doubled IPA, but don't. Where is it? It said double, right? Yeah, double. And then we had the eye alcohol content, which is 8.5, right? Yep. 8.5. Color, cloudy yellow, or gold, actually, cloudy gold or wheat. Price, I think it was like two something. I'm not sure because I bought other, I bought that other Halloween-ish beer. Um, it does have kind of a hopsy taste to it, citrus, fruity kind of. Uh, it's a very smooth finish. It's dry. Uh, heavy. Definitely heavy. And it is a con. Nice beer. But before we give the rating, of course, I'm going to take another sip. Just to make sure the, the head there, the fizz on the top, it's simmer down now. Okay, simmer down. <sighs> so toast in the weekend. Get ready for Halloween coming. If you don't like Halloween, I don't know what's wrong with you. Because it's fun. <laughs> definitely, definitely got a real citrusy taste. And I like this one. I like the other one too, but... I don't know. Something about this. It's not even the black and white old school can that's 
upside down optical illusion for y'all it just has a nice taste so the moment you've been waiting for if i had a drum roll i'd be playing it four stars baby four stars this is good i like it i'm not gonna be crunching and eating on the camera as much okay try, try to cut it down okay thank you guys so much for joining me i appreciate it show some love hit that thumbs up share the video so it gets out to more and more people we can do more like this the series is up until halloween then i don't know if we're gonna still do the beer we may change it to something else we'll see anyway we've done some other stuff so you know we got we got stuff to explore we'll think about it and check it out okay thank you guys so much for watching i do do appreciate you have a great day remember the headphones are coming this week all right